Theresa May's cabinet is at war over no deal after Philip Hammond said Brexiteer Tories have no mandate for no deal. Andrew Leadsom has hit back at the Chancellor by saying that Britain must leave the EU on October 31st at all costs as infighting among Theresa May's ministers broke out. Today the Prime Minister will present her bold new deal to her cabinet which is packed with Brexiteers and Remainers all plotting to replace her. Tonight Mr Hammond will use a keynote speech to blast to worry leadership candidates including Boris Johnson, saying those advocating no deal are hijacking the result of the referendum. But Ams led some hit back today, I would like us to have a deal but if we get to the end of October and it's not possible to get a deal. Leaving the EU is the most important thing. Ams Ledza refused to be drawn on whether she would resign if Mrs May tries to push for a permanent customs union to appease Labour MPs, but several ministers are said to be considering their futures. Andrea Ledsom has hit back at the Chancellor Philip Hammond by saying that Britain must leave the EU on October 31st. Whatever happens Theresa May faces her warring cabinet today and will have to convince them to back her Brexit plan related articles previous one next I am not a drunk. EU Commission President Jean Claude. Ex-Story Deputy Prime Minister Lord Hasseltine, 86, has the share this article share. The weekly meeting of the Cabinet today is expected to sign off on a package of measures to be included in the forthcoming Withdrawal Agreement Bill, WAB, aimed at winning cross-party support. Brexit Secretary Stephen Barclay has said that the government must now prepare for no deal if MPs throw out Mrs May's deal for a fourth time. Mr Barclay has the backing of new Defence Secretary Penny Mordaunt and Leader of the House of Commons Ems.